Happy freaking Saturday, everybody. And welcome to beautiful, sunny Sacramento, California. It is so nice out right now, I cannot believe it. Like, I'm seeing it, I'm experiencing it, my body won't let me believe it. Tomorrow is the first Wrangler meetup in California at McKinley Park in Sacramento. Also, on Monday, I have a CB radio antenna mount coming for Jade, as well as the storage containers. And also, there's something coming for Annie. Also, Sacramento is the capital of California, and I'm hitting up every state capital on this 50 state road trip. So we need to stay in the area for the next couple days and instead of sleeping at Walmarts or wherever else I can park, Ken insisted that we stay here and then also we have a garage to work on much needed you know, upgrades and maintenance that need to be done to Jade. Normally I don't stay in one area for any longer than a couple days, but since there's so much going on right now, it just kind of makes sense too. It's seriously so gorgeous out right now. I'm loving this. It is the perfect day to start doing some maintenance on Jade. First off today, Upgrading the power inverter. This bad boy is a 1000 watt freaking power inverter. My mom actually bought me this for Christmas. Thanks mom, I love you. Annie's recovering great. She's still not licking the insertion, so she still doesn't have to wear the cone. I'm proud of her. She's gonna come hang out with me while I'm working on Jade today. Hello. Hi. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Hi. <laughs> this wasn't supposed to come till Monday. It came today. Amy, this is for you. You're gonna love this. I'm gonna open this up later. Can't get distracted. Gotta keep working on Jade. Since the wiring is already all hooked up, all I should have to do is disconnect the negative and positive from this power inverter and reconnect it to the negative and positive to this power inverter. Plug and play. Let's see if it works. Aha! We got a green light. We got power. Oh, it makes a cool little sound. Cool little sound when it turns off, I guess. Oh, missed it. That looks way better than duct taping it to the brake release. All right, there we go. This is so much cleaner. Got rid of this whole mess that was over here. Every time I would step out, my boot would catch it and unplug things. That's gone. No more duct tape to the brake release. And this is so much cleaner. I don't, I mean, it's sturdy on there too. I don't think it's going anywhere. Most importantly, we got power. And everything is hooked up. Got the Canon, the GoPro, the computer, and the drone. Perfect. Oh, well, I am happy with that. Wouldn't you say, Annie? Wouldn't you say? Pretty good install, huh? So this is me sitting in here, and uh, my knees completely clear it. You know, I'm not hitting it or nothing. Great upgrade. Thanks, Mom. These visors are actually adjustable. They're by Rugged Ridge. And 
it may look like one rod, but it's actually two separate rods, so you can adjust them until the holes line up. But a lot of the reviews, people are like, no, it's the wrong one. They don't fit. And then there'd be a review underneath and say, no, actually they're adjustable. And then, you know, the person just looks really stupid. So you always read the reviews before you buy something. So I already knew that they were adjustable when I got them. Kyle Doiron, Adam Simon, Zane Clark Hope, Mitch McCann, Dalton Lariano, Zach Clarkin, and Robert Williamson. Adam, Kyle, Zane, Mitch, Dalton, Zach, Robert, thank you guys so much for becoming new Patreon pledges. I've never picked up this many Patreon pledges in one day. It's unbelievable. So a huge thank you to you guys. Annie, Jade, and I really appreciate it. Tomorrow's the first California meetup, and I cannot wait to meet so many of you guys. As always, everybody, thank you so much for hanging out with us, and we will see you tomorrow.